Hey everyone, this is Jay, and today I'll be showing you how to back up your iOS to a TFTP server. Um, here we have Hyper Terminal connected to one of the routers. Um, we're going to be using SolarWinds TFTP server software, and we're going to start with configuring this. Just want to start the TFTP, and here's the directory of all the files that are going to be. This is where the files are going to be saved, and here's the folder. Currently, it's empty right now. So after we're done with this, you're going to see the iOS stored in here. Just want to press OK, and the service is started. All right, so you want to do is type in the show flash command, and this will give some information of the iOS and the name, which you're going to need. So you just want to copy it. Okay, so now you want to type in the command copy flash tftp. All right, so address of the re of the remote host, which is 10.10.10.2. Just want to press enter. Source file name is this right here. The destination file name is if you want to, in case you want to change the name, but we're just gonna stick with the same thing. And uh, this is when the transfer will begin. Just type in yes. And currently right now it's transferring to the TFTP server. This might take about a minute. So just bear with me. Luckily this one's just a lot smaller. I've transferred twelve the iOS twelve something and it took about three minutes this should only take uh, about a minute or so Alright, so the upload to the server is done. So now we're going to open up the, the directory. Alright, and you see here that we transferred the this file, the iOS file, into the TFTP server. So now just in case, if what you want to do is, um, if you would like to update an iOS, you want to transfer it to a TFTP server and then transfer it back to the router's flash. Uh, the way you do that is basically the copy tftp flash command and this is the same thing but just reversed alright so that's how you um, back up your ios to a tftp server